Wakiongozi na gavana wa Kitui Charity Ngilu katika uzinduzi rasmi wa ripoti ya BBI katika ukumbi wa Bomas mapema leo, viongozi wa kina mama wamesema kuwa ipo haja kuhakikisha kuwa kuna usawa wa kijinsia katika nyadhfa za uongozi serikalini ikizingatiwa kuwa katiba iliyoko sasa haijaangazia kwa kina swala la usawa wa kijinsia. Remember there is a serious threat of Chief Justice Maraga that he must have to that general. And the is that it is not others, it is we women who are targeted. You see, the seven depositions that will be given to the National Assembly, then put it there that they will all, all of them, go to women. All of them, have exception. Ni usemi ulioungwa mkono naye mbunge wa Likoni Mishi Mboko ambaye amesema kuwa ripoti ya BBI itawainua kina mama kuchukua uongozi. Vile vile katika seneta sasa hivi tulikuwa tu na masenesa wateuliwa 16 na wale watatu tu wachache waliochaguliwa. Lakini sasa tutapata sauti ya kina mama waliochaguliwa kikura watakao kuwa na haki ya kupiga kura pale katika bunge la seneti na kuweza kufanya maamuzi ya kuhusu mambo ya county government zetu pale mashinani kwa upande wake naibu rais William Ruto amesema kuwa kuwahusisha kina mama katika uongozi wa nchi ni njia moja ya kufanya nchi kuwa na umaarufu zaidi ili mradi tu seneti isalie kuwa na nguvu iliyokuwa nayo when women go to the senate they are going to a senate which has been downgraded which has no responsibility on matters of resource allocation are you enhancing the participation of women or are you downgrading the participation of women aidha mamlaka ya seneti kulingana na katiba ni pamoja na kutunga sheria ugavi wa rasilimali na pia kutathmini utendakazi wa viongozi wa kuserikalini kutoka uongozini kama vile rais na naibu wake spika wa seneti na naibu wake na pia magavana swali kuu likiwa ni je katika mabadiliko yaliyoangaziwa katika BBI seneti itasalia na majukumu hayo Wapo kina mama ambao wangali kusoma ripoti hiyo ili kuielewa na ni vipi mapendekezo katika ripoti hiyo yatakuwa ya manufaa kwao kabla ya kuelekea debeni kutoa uamuzi wao. Mimi kwa ukweli sijaisoma. Sasa mimi pia ningependa nilifikie nisome ili mpate kuielewa ikifika hapo sio kupiga kura, kura yangu isipotee. Jaelewa hii mambo na BBI but nimesikia kwa TV kuwa wamama pia wamepewa first priority kwa nini? Azin kama mimi nani umwanza ni president kama baba ni president mama pia anaweza kuwa deputy president wake Robi Omondi K24 saa moja